Now at 11, chaos at the Coastone Creamery in Greenwood. A vehicle slams into the building while workers and customers are inside. Thank you so much for staying up late with us tonight. I'm Amber Grigley. The crash happened around 8 o'clock tonight at the Coldstone location on US 31. The shopping center was busy at the time. Several people were injured. Our Lauren Casey talked with Greenwood Police and has the latest on their investigation. And the police tape is still up here at the Coldstone Creamery in Greenwood. We're right across the street from the Greenwood Park Mall in the same strip mall as the Bed Bath & Beyond off Fry Road in US 31. You can see here inside, this is the scene tonight just before 8 o'clock where this SUV drove through the glass there on the east side of the building while people were inside. Right now we're told there were no deaths here at the scene, but four people had to be transported to Methodist Hospital, two of them with pretty severe injuries, two others others who were stable at the scene. They tell us that a few other people may have had some minor cuts or bruises, but only four people were transported here. Right now we know that police applied a tourniquet to one woman at the scene who took a direct hit from this vehicle. Now what we know from Greenwood police who talked to the gentleman in this SUV, he was with his family and going to park on the east side of the building. He tells police instead of hitting the brake, he hit the accelerator and went through the building here. So police, as far as they know right now, they believe this was an accident. They're continuing their investigation as you can see. Greenwood police tell me that they did conduct a field sobriety test on the gentleman who drove through this building. They say he passed the test and is cooperating with police. We'll continue to keep you updated as we learn any new details. Reporting from Greenwood, Lauren Casey, WRTV.